I'm Kevin McNair. Uh, I work for Beta Construction, and I'm an estimator there. And my name is Tom Roward, and I also work at Mater. I've been an estimator there for 13 years. We're a drywall, metal stud, acoustic sealing company. We do a little bit of plaster and a little bit of spray fireproofing. I may have missed that, but where's your headquarters? At? We're in Buffalo, New York. Buffalo, New York. Yes. Okay. And uh, most of the jobs that you guys do, are they like around that area? Or yeah, we, like we stay within areas? about a two or three hour radius. Two or three hours. Western New York, northern Pennsylvania, things along those lines. Did you enjoy the training today? Yes, it was, uh, it was very knowledgeable. I learned a lot today. Um, it's the first time using the software in the program. Uh, it was easy to follow along. Uh, the training was went very well. Awesome. Um, did you have any outstanding questions or anything uh, regarding OST? No, it, no? Was, it was rather thorough, almost to the point of being too thorough. There was a lot of information thrown at us over an eight-hour day or whatever yeah. it was. But, uh, but you got plenty of handouts and stuff uh, to go home and oh, yeah, review. Right. Awesome. Do um, you think it's going to help you guys when, when you get back? You know, Are you going to be able to retain it, do you think, oh, and apply yes. it? Awesome. You've been at Estimator for what, two years? Yes, about two years. And uh, you're just starting using our software, yes. right? Yes, yep. Now, before you were using our software, um, what what was your what were you using before to, to do all your estimating? Uh, just manual takeoff, hand takeoff, uh, green pad, writing all the uh, stuff down. Now, um, if you compare that that method to using on-screen takeoff and quick bid, um, what, do you think that you're going to see a difference? Oh, yes, absolutely. I can't wait to go back and, and use uh, screen takeoff, actually. and um, It's going to save a bunch of time. <laughs> awesome. And, and you, sir, um, what is your experience with our software? In it's particular? been a, almost a year and a half now. We had used the Edge before that, and we have done, and we did quick bid years even before that, before the on-screen, just the hand takeoff of use quick bid. Okay. And that was, so probably off and on, it's been about four or five years using your products. Has the software helped your business at all, do you think? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Just our ability to bid more work, if that reason alone, without knowing the exact percentages of jobs received, but just that alone, I know we bid more work than we were able to bid a year and a half ago. Oh. Has it improved your communication at all between the office and the field? or? Mm -hmm. Yeah, every, really? Any kind of information is good information, and this gives us the opportunity to give good information. We just finished a, what was our biggest one-time bid project, the Global Vascular Institute in Buffalo, New York, using quick bid and on-screen takeoff, and though the job's not 100% finished yet, we're really excited about the outcome, and it could turn out and the ability to go floor by floor, wing by wing, division by division has really helped our guys out in the field stock it, build it, and everything else. And all that was done by just typical areas and you know different things like that. It was really pretty cool. So while you were using the software, you were still using paper and scales we have, and we have a very yes. archaic way of training. <laughs> <laughs> that if you don't know what a piece of paper and how to do it by hand, none of the formulas on any program will mean anything until you know how to build something 16 inches on size. Gotcha, gotcha. Dinosaur, caveman, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> Can you talk about some of the challenges you came across when working on that particular project? The, 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 the biggest challenge was the scheduling part of it. Multiple areas going at multiple times using multiple foremen. The, in, in essence, though it was one job, it was run like 10 or 15 small or little jobs. Mm -hmm. And the ability to extract information from one area and give that to the people that needed it, in lieu of just set, rolling them a 150 set, paid set of drawings, here, build this, mm -hmm. just that, that alone was priceless out in the field. To know they had X amount of lineal feet of something to put in and that was right off the image legend and all that. It really, if nothing else, that saved them. Awesome. Let alone stock lists, being able to pull areas out by stock lists and things like that. Um, 
How's business going for you guys so far? Good. It's been busy. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good thing. One of the benefits we have of being in a, a smaller town is that we don't get those big ups and downs. Buffalo itself has been rather constant. Awesome. When you guys down here 10 years ago were living the high life, <laughs> we didn't quite get there, but when things dipped in California, we also didn't get down here. It's starting to pick up out here, though. Um, yeah. Right. Uh, yeah, we we have a, lo a lot of clients in the in the area, and some of their feedback is yeah, it's definitely picking up out here. Yeah, it, it's it's picking up. It's better. It certainly could be a lot better. <laughs> uh, would you recommend on Center software to other companies? Absolutely, and we do. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think um, is holding uh, some companies back from using software? You know. They just like paper and yeah, scales? No, it, or? It's, it, it, I think it's the, the old dog, new tricks. We're Buffalo itself, our region itself is an older, you know, most of the guys, Kevin's one of the few young ones. He's, you're probably the youngest in our company by what, 10 years? Yeah, about 10 years. Yeah, you know, that most of us have been doing it. I've been estimating for 25 years. It's just, you get used to doing it a particular way and that's just it. It's awesome. Kevin's father is our chief estimator, and he he'll never take a pencil out of his hand, <laughs> no matter what you do. Thirty-five years the same yeah. way. So, are you like long-term career goals? Are you looking just to stay as an estimator, or do you want to move into something else? Or? Uh, just primarily staying as an estimator. Really, yes. following I'm your father's footsteps. Yeah, it's a big cheese. He remembers the rest of us. <laughs>